So I don't represent any of the people in it. I have no cock in the fight. This is John Brown, an attorney and author of Procurement Law or Procurement Law, a Guam Procurement Process Primer, which is a basic reference source of Guam Procurement Law. During the two-day special session, lawmakers asked Brown to present his views pertaining to procurement laws with the new JFK bill. Brown says he's very satisfied with the new bill that was passed last night, but thinks the proposed legislation has problematic language in it. Brown is a purist of procurement law. I would have preferred, from a very purely principled approach, to see this thing handled all the way through to the conclusion without any new legislation. I'd like to see how the process works. He says lawmakers were practical and made amendments to maintain the integrity of the procurement system to get this bill complete. But he says the new bill passed may present something that might be objectionable and could bring some sort of legal action. What that legal action would be, uh, how, how, what, what its base is, I, I won't, I won't speculate. Uh, I'll be very fascinated to see how it plays out. Um, uh, uh, as a interested observer, it's fun. I'm sure for the people involved in it, it's absolutely hair pulling out time. He says if there were another protest, once things got inside the court it could disappear into a black hole. And as uh, uh, the Attorney General said, uh, to the, when asked what is his uh, anticipation of what a court might rule, he refused to speculate. I would agree with him on that. <laughs> you just don't speculate on that. Meanwhile, JFK stakeholders are elated that their voices were heard, and a new JFK will be coming soon. Thank you, Senators! Thank, Thank you, Governor! David Macaluso, PNC News.